Hey, 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 good looking. I'm so glad that you came to my kitchen for this Whip It Up Wednesday's dish. And boy, do I have a doozy. We're going to be whipping up breakfast monkey bread. And we're going to be rocking out with our crocs out. So grab a hold of that vine. Swing right on to my kitchen so we can get cooking. Good looking. And I'm so glad that you came to my kitchen because I'm going to sit there and show you just how easy it is to use our slow cooker. And we're going to sit there and make a breakfast monkey bread. Now, let's go ahead and let's get started. Now, I have inside the slow cooker, I have one eighth cup of butter melting. As you can sit there and see and while that is all melting and I have it on warm just to melt the butter I'm gonna sit there and take two of these Pillsbury Grand Cinnamon Rolls we're gonna open them up and each one of them biscuits we're gonna cut into eighths all right, now I sat there and I sliced them all up into eighths, as you see. Let's take our cover off. And now all that melted butter on the inside of our crock pots is what we're going to sit there and roll each and one of these little pieces of sweet roll all in. So I'm going to sit there and add all these and stir it all up. Now let's just sit there and uh, mix this all up to get that butter kind of over every piece that we have inside of our slow cooker here. Oh, does this smell good? Even though it's not even you know, baked, it's in the beginning stages. Oh my goodness. Okay. I think we have every piece good and coated, as you all can sit there and see. Now, over here, don't throw them away. Put them off to the side. Now, grab a bowl and we'll be right back. I have our bowl and now we're going to need six eggs along with half of a cup of whipping cream. And you're going to want to use one fourth cup of maple syrup and we're going to mix them three ingredients all together now make sure that you break the yolks before trying to mix them up because it just helps the aid in mixing them when the yolks are pre-broken now go ahead give the eggs a good whip and then we're going to sit there and add, add half of a cup of the heavy whipping cream along with one fourth cup of the maple syrup. So let's go ahead, add the heavy whipping cream. Mix that all in. Grab that one fourth cup of maple syrup and mix that in as well. Okay, I'm going to remove my spatula and now let's go ahead and drizzle this all over the top of our monkey bread inside of our slow cookers. Mm -hmm. 
grab your cover give this all one last mix to make sure that all them sweet roll pieces are mingling with what I would sit there and say is the custard sauce that we all put inside here with the eggs and give it all a good you know little juice put your cover on now before I put my cover on I'm just going to sit there with the towel put it over the top like this that way it captures any of the moisture so it does not go dripping down inside onto the or onto our monkey bread now go ahead if you have a locking feature on your slow cooker go ahead lock your cover on I'm going to sit there and push or not push I'm going to select low on the dial and I'm going to sit there and allow this to cook for two and a half hours we'll see you then Now, if you're a new subscriber to my channel, welcome. And if you're not yet a subscriber, please go up, hit that subscribe button, tap that little bell. That way you always be notified every time I do put out a new video. And help me support my channel here by spreading the word, sharing this recipe with others. And most of all, here's to happy cooking, but better yet, happy eatings. Y'all come back now. You hear?